There have been some gross misperceptions about life insurance underwriting that sadly have persisted over the years. Just a few examples of these misperceptions include how information is shared with the Medical Information Bureau, or MIB, the value of reinsurance, and whether specific medical procedures may prevent one from obtaining life insurance. It's imperative to discern facts from fiction in the underwriting process in order to determine the best course of action for your valued client. Your Prompt Underwriting Team is here to help dispel these myths and misperceptions. Pertinent underwriting information is exchanged in simple encryption form called codes between MIB and member insurance companies. These codes act as alerts to identify areas needing underwriting scrutiny. MIB codes may be medical or non-medical, positive or negative, admitted or unadmitted. For example, skydiving, diabetes, and a negative nicotine lab result in an alternate tobacco user may all be coded regardless of how the insurance company learned of the history. Contrary to what some may think, final actions are not coded. If an applicant is declined due to diabetes, the diabetes history is coded, not the decline. Codes do not identify the specific insurance carrier that reported the code or what underwriting action was taken by that company. To learn more about MIB and how a client's pertinent medical and non-medical information is collected and coded, click on the link in the video description.